What's up? Today we're going to be going over my top 10 favorite civil structural engineering YouTube channels. It's not going to be in any particular order, but I am going to save the biggest channels till the very end. Make sure to check out these channels and if you like them, make sure to like and subscribe to their videos, particularly if they're the smaller creators. Structural engineering is a small community and we should do the best that we can to support each other. Plus, I'm taking my licensing exam soon, so you probably won't see content from me in about a month. Links to all these channels in the description below. Let's jump into it. The first channel is Brendan Hasty. Brendan is a structural engineer in Australia with over 15 years of experience and he's worked on a variety of different structural engineering projects. I've had a chance to talk to him and not only is he a great guy, but he's also a family man. He's also one of my favorite structural engineering YouTubers out there. Not only does he have good production, but he's very consistent on his videos as well. He's got videos ranging from career advice to structural engineering, design philosophies and approaches, and anything else structural engineering related. So go check out his channel below. I think you'll like it. The next channel is Tyler Lay. He's a professor at Oklahoma State University and he teaches structural engineering classes there. But man, does this guy love concrete. He does research about it. He teaches about it. He dreams about it. His spirit animal or material is concrete and if he was in the last airbender, he would be a concrete bender. So of course his YouTube channel is about concrete. He has awesome energy and if you wanna see why his channel has over 8 million views and you wanna learn something about concrete, make sure to go check out his channel. Next channel is Everyday Daz. Darren's a chartered engineer in the UK with a variety of design projects ranging from small houses to multi-million dollar projects. His videos consist of structural engineering career advice, design, tutorials, and even some tech. What I really like about his channel is his presentation. He uses some really cool sketching software that I think is from Apple that makes his sketches and diagrams really stand out and easy to follow. I really like that because I am a visual person and who knew that you could use Apple products in structural engineering. Go check out his channel if you wanna learn more about structural engineering and if you really appreciate visuals and pretty sketches. The next channel is Structure Free. From his YouTube channel description, this guy is a professor, a licensed engineer with degrees in civil structural engineering and a wannabe baller. Chica, chica. Structure Freeze videos, oh man, I would describe them as edutainment. Not only does he do a great job of teaching some complex structural engineering concepts, but he has the personality and energy to make it entertaining for you, the viewer or the student, chica, chica. which is a breath of fresh air if you're falling asleep in your engineering classes. How effective is he? He's 23 million views effective. So if you want to learn more about the structural engineering fundamentals and be entertained at the same time, make sure to go check out his channel. Next YouTube channel that's up is Kestava. Rich, who runs the Kestava channel, is a licensed civil engineer in the US. He's got real world structural engineering design experience, so his channel has structural engineering career advice videos, but what he loves the most and does best is doing step-by-step -step structural engineering design examples. I like these because you get plenty of theoretical stuff at school, but you don't get probably as many practical design examples that you would practically do in the real world. If you want to learn about structural engineering design and how we design structures in the real world, make sure to go check out his channel below. I'm a big proponent of practical design examples and learn by doing, and that's why I'd like to thank Brilliant for sponsoring today's video. Brilliant is an awesome tool for learning STEM interactively that helps you to truly understand concepts in math, science, and computer science by guiding you through engaging hands-on courses. For example, take this lesson in balance and the center of mass. Instead of starting off with a wall of equations or formulas that you probably did in your science class, Brilliant starts you off with a relatively simple explanation on how it's used in the real world, like skyscrapers and rockets. Then they give you a visual, intuitive, and interactive example that helps you better understand the concept, such as balancing a rod with weights on both ends. To get started for free, visit brilliant.org slash or click on the link in the description below. And the first 200 people will get 20% off Brilliant's annual premium subscription. The next YouTube channel that we're gonna go over is Dirk Bondi. His channel's a great resource if you've never taken a post-tension concrete class before because while well, he posts his class, his full lectures, up on his channel, completely free. And what I really like about it is he's practical. 
He's worked in the industry for a lot of years and he's a post-tension concrete expert. He even wrote the book on post-tension concrete that I recommend highly to any design professionals that are working in the field and are working in post-tension concrete. I'll link that book in the description below. So if you've never taken a PT concrete class before, now you have no excuse. Next YouTube channel that's up is the Engineering Management Institute. This is my favorite civil engineering career channel, particularly if you're looking to be a manager or rise up through the ranks and be a leader in the industry. I believe that technical skills can only take you so far in the engineering industry. You're going to need to learn about some of the soft skills such as leadership and management and how to treat and interact with different types of people. Those are the skills that are really going to help you stand out, succeed, become a leader and be effective and help others in your firm. What's cool about this channel is that you get to hear from real life engineers. You get to hear about their stories, the lessons they learned, the technical topics that they specialized in. And it's not just structural engineering. The videos range from civil, geotechnical, and structural engineering experts. And the podcast that I co-host, the Structural Engineering Channel, those videos are up there as well in case you wanted to view them in video format instead of just listening to them on audio. So make sure to check out that channel if you want an extraordinary engineering career. Now let's jump into my favorite mainstream YouTube channels that you probably know of already. And that's why I'm just gonna quickly go through. The first one that comes to mind is the Efficient Engineer. I really like them because they have crazy visuals, everything's in 3D, and they're explaining complex concepts at the same time. The production values are off the charts and they're well scripted as well. So it's a really cool way to see some of the concepts such as stresses and beams and the finite element analysis method. The next channel is the B1M. This is more of a construction channel, but I like their footage that they're able to get of these really cool buildings that are under construction. And they explain some of the challenges that go on uh, during design and construction that you probably won't appreciate if you're not in the architectural engineering construction industry. They have some really cool mega project footage and that's always a delight to see some of the scale and some of the challenges and crazy structures that the world is coming up with. And the last one is Practical Engineering. It's not really a structural engineering channel, but he often goes into topics such as retaining walls and footings. What I really love about this channel is he explains complex engineering topics in everyday terms, in ways that most normal people can appreciate and understand. And believe it or not, I think that's one of the hardest things that engineers can do. Talking to another engineer about engineering, that's really easy. But you gotta go talk to engineering, to normies, that's really hard. So I really appreciate what he's doing on his channel. Thanks for watching. Those are my favorite structural engineering YouTube channels. If I missed yours, make sure to post it in the comments below. Have a great day and I'll see you next time.